How can I reduce my hepatitis B viral load naturally? As you know, acute hepatitis B lasts for a short period of time and chronic hepatitis B lasts for at least six months. But if you are suffering from chronic career, you may carry the hepatitis B virus for the rest of your life. In this video we will discuss how can you control or reduce HBV viral load neither any medication nor any therapy but in a natural way. So please watch this video till end. We are contact with many HBV patients. They are suffering from chronic HBV since 15 years till date. They are healthy and alive. They did not take any medicines to control the virus, but they are always in follow-up as well as prescribed as doctor. So, I would request you, please follow up these tips this will help you ahead. In many research found, stress is the cause of many diseases because it is lower CD4 cell counts, CD4 T lymphocytes or helper T cells. If any patient in the stress or have anxiety with higher viral load, then there is elevated in the disease progression seen. Too much stress could work against your HBV or HCV treatment. Raising the viral load in your blood and making it more likely that your HBV will progress to acquired chronic hepatitis B. Hepatitis virus can destroy your immune system. However, hepatitis virus can destroy your immune system's ability to fight infection and may lead to death. If you have a lot of stress and are finding it hard to stay on top of your treatment plan, tell your doctor about it immediately. A positive anti-HBs or HBSAB test result means you are immune and protected against the hepatitis B virus and cannot be infected. You are not infected non-reactive and cannot spread hepatitis B to others. HBV DNA. The normal range for this assay is not detected. The quantitative range of this assay is 1.00 to 9.00 log IU per milliliter means 10 minus 1 billion IU per milliliter. You can add to your diet plenty of fruits and vegetables, whole grains brown rice, barley, and lean protein, low-fat or non-fat dairy products, healthy fats like those in nuts, avocados, and olive oil etc. Follow healthy diet. A hepatitis patient what should take in the regular diet? We have already made a video about hepatitis patient's diet plan. Please find in our channel. Following vitamins and minerals are beneficial for hepatitis patients. The anti-HBV effect of most of these nutrients has been analyzed. Resveratrol, vitamin E, lactoferrin, selenium, curcumin, lutein 7 o glucoside Moringa leaf extracts, chlorogenic acid, epigallocatechin gallate. Note. Please consult with your doctor before taking any oral medications. Regular exercise is very important for HBV, HCV patients. Do exercise regularly. A recent study found that middle-aged men who exercised at least 240 minutes a week were able to greatly improve damage caused by fatty liver disease. It has been proven that exercise benefits patients and decreases liver enzymes and fat in the liver. Regular exercise including stretching, running, speed walking, medium aerobic exercise, yoga and pranayama is good for chronic career patients. Do not do heavy weight exercise this is not good for your health. Do not take any steroid or whey or artificial proteins to grow muscles. Get enough sleep. How much sleep do you need to boost your immune system? The optimal amount of sleep for most adults is 7 to 8 hours of good sleep each night. Teenagers need 9 to 10 hours of sleep. Take care of your liver. Alcohol adversely affects hepatitis B or C virus infections in the liver by promoting viral replication, increasing oxidative stress, suppressing the viral immune responses. The interaction of alcohol with viral hepatitis contributes to an increased risk of developing HBV or HCV-induced liver fibrosis, end-stage cirrhosis, and even deadly liver cancer. Make sure, before taking any medicine, check with your pharmacist about any over-the-counter drugs like acetaminophen, paracetamol, 
or non-hepatitis B prescription drugs before taking them to make sure they are safe for your liver since many of these drugs are processed through your liver. Keep away from chemicals. Avoid inhaling fumes from paint, paint thinners, glue, pesticides, household cleaning products, nail polish removers, and other potentially toxic chemicals that could damage your liver. Keep in mind everything you eat, drink, breathe, or absorb through the skin is eventually filtered by the liver. So, protect your liver and your health. Do following medical tests in every three to six months to monitor liver condition. Your healthcare provider will examine you and look for signs of liver damage. These tests are that can help diagnose hepatitis B or its complications need to follow up in every three to six months for chronic patients. ALT, AST, Fibroscan, Whole Abdominal Ultrasound, AFP, HBV, HCV DNA, Liver Biopsy, Endoscopy. Keep in mind everything you eat, drink, breathe, or absorb through the skin is eventually filtered by the liver. So protect your liver and your health. If you like this video, please like and subscribe our channel. Please share with us in the comment box if you have any new tips or ideas about hepatitis B infection are welcome.